हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज अंजलि वाहिंगम एंड यू आर वाचिंग मनु लाइव टॉप 20 न्यूज़ इन अ सेंसेशनल इंसिडेंट अ पर्सन हैज बीन इंजर्ड इन फायरिंग इन गुवाहाटी इन ब्रॉड डेलाइट टुडे द इंजर्ड पर्सन हैज बीन आइडेंटिफाइड एज गौतम पाल द इंसिडेंट टुक प्लेस इन द एडजसन लोकैलिटीज ऑफ बरसपारा एंड हिरेनपारा एट अ ज्वेलरी शॉप व्हेन सिक्स डेकॉर्ड्स ओपन फायर ऑन गौतम पाल Chief Minister's special vigilance sent by SP Rozi Kalita has arrested suspended Assam Police Deputy Inspector General Rana Gali Hazarika from his residence at Rub Konwar Path in the Angravari area of Gauhati city for allegedly amassing assets disproportionate to his known sources of income. He was suspended in July for allegedly going abroad on several occasions since 2011 without taking necessary permission from Assam government. A team led by SDP Olakipur, Kula Pradeep Bhattacharya with OC Jirighat, OC Joypur and a team from Dima Hasao launched a joint operation in Bijung Sao Basti and the Jirighat police station. And in the raid, factory made muzzle loading gun, gunpowder, bullets, camouflage dress and hunting boots have been recovered from the possession of two individuals. Darney Thom Mar, son of Kong Khao Lal Mar from Bijung Sao village and Jehova Choriai, son of Lato Glen Choriai have been apprehended. Chief Minister Himanta Biswa Sharma attended a Red Ching Room Amai 2021 at Lokimon Sangha Ashama at Dolamara Karbi Anglong today and also he paid a visit to Lokimon Sangha Guru Madan Engti Hansek and sought his blessings. After the Executive Council of Gauhati University meeting today the main accused in the Institute Distance and Open Learning scam Kandarpa Das has been suspended from Guwahati University. He was the former director of Idol. Bharatiya Janata Party nominated Kingston Marakov, its West Garo Hills district for the Rajpala constituency. On the other hand, Congress has decided to contest in all the three seats and announced the candidate's name Hasina Yasmin Mandal from Rajpala constituency, Highlander Kharmalki from Mauring Nang and Kennedy C Khairim from Moflang constituency. Dimapur-based civil society organizations under the aegis of the core committee against shifting of the DC office took out a rally at Dimapur against shifting of the Dimapur deputy. Bharatiya Janata Party has named state party spokesperson and former student leader K. Lal Dindhara as the party candidate for the upcoming bipol tutorial assembly seat which is scheduled to be held on October 30. Vice President M Venkaiah Naidu arrived in Imphal today on a two-day official visit to the state and this is his first visit to Manipur as the Vice President. West Bengal's Mamta Banerjee along with Trinamool Congress leaders Zakir Hussain and Amirul Islam will be sworn in as MLAs of the West Bengal Assembly on October 7. Union Minister of Petroleum and Natural Gas, Housing and Urban Affairs Hardeep Singh Puri distributed free LPG connections to poor women under the Prime Minister's Ujwala Yojana at Kakori Lucknow in Uttar Pradesh. Union Agriculture Minister Barendra Singh Tomar along with Union Minister for Development of North Eastern Region G Kishan Reddy and several other dignitaries deliberated significance of the ambitious national mission on edible oils oil palm. Union Ministry for Road Transport and Highways has issued guidelines for the scheme for grant of award to the good samaritan who has saved the life of a victim from a fatal accident involving a motor vehicle by administering immediate assistance and rushing to hospital trauma care center within the golden hour of the accident to provide medical treatment which will be in place from October 15 2021 till March 31 2026 In an effort to promote indigenous and geographical identification tax products, first consignment of GI tax with dish Mihidana sourced from Bardhaman, West Bengal has been exported to the Kingdom of Bahrain. The consignment of unique sweet dish Mihidana was exported to Bahrain by Epita registered MSDM Enterprises Kolkata and exported by Al Jazeera Group Bahrain. Indian Air Force Chief Marshal VR Chaudhry said that the Chinese Air Force is still present on the three air bases 
on their side of the line of actual control and assured that the Indian Air Force is fully deployed and prepared. Prime Minister Narendra Modi inaugurated Azadi at the Rate 75 New Urban India Transforming Urban Landscape Conference Come Expo in Lucknow today. The Prime Minister digitally handed over the keys of Pradhan Mantri Awaz Yojana Urban Houses to 75,000 beneficiaries in 75 districts of Uttar Pradesh and also interacted virtually with the beneficiaries of the scheme in Uttar Pradesh. National Health Authority, the apex body for implementing Ayushman Bharat Pradhan Mantri Jan Arogya Yojana, has revised the health benefit package master under the scheme. The Nobel Prize for Physics has been awarded to scientists from Japan, Germany and Italy. Sukuro Manabe and Klaus Hasselmann were cited for their work in the physical modeling of Earth's climate, quantifying variability and reliability predicting global warming. The second half of the prize was awarded to Giorgio Parisi for the discovery of the interplay of disorder and fluctuations in physical systems from atomic to planetary scales. Tokyo Olympics bronze medalist Lavlina Borgohai has been handed direct qualification for the upcoming Women's World Boxing Championships by the Indian Federation, which has decided that the remaining squad will be made up of gold winners from the upcoming nationals. And today's Assam COVID-19 update, total positive cases 385, recovery rate 98.29% and total death cases 7. That's the end of Top 20 News. Thank you for watching.